this wasn't the end of the basketball final between USA and Russia. It could have been if you consider the emotions. Jojo Fallas had just scored the 21-12 point lead for the US at the end of the first quarter. This should be the highest lead of the Americans in the whole match, not without reason. The game was highly competitive. Rarely one of the players made a basket without interruption like Jeremia Kreisberg. His putback dunk, impressive. Points under the basket were scored very seldom in this game. Both teams preferred to shoot from the distance. 21 three-pointers found their way into the basket. Until halftime, the Russians had turned the match, went into the lead, 41 to 36 the score. In the second half, the lead went back and forth. In the end, the US ran out of time. On Thursday, the team of head coach BJ Dunn had defeated the Russians 79 to 71. In the final, this didn't work out because they just missed too many baskets. Roman Mursin with the last impressive dunk for the Russians to win the match and he knew right away why his team was better today. It's, uh, we are not afraid. I think it's the first. Because if you try to afraid of the United States, because it's icon, we watch on TV all the basketball of the United States. And if you go and fight, if you're not afraid, you have hope to win. With the 98 to 87 victory, the Russians took revenge for the defeat at the Maccabiade two years ago in Israel. The disappointment this time on the American side, although the game had started so promising for them.